Hey, what's up guys? It's Krabby John and I'm here to not make a video about a free limited UGC. That's right, I am here to bash some games. Look at this. I need to defeat a couple bosses and then hatch a bunch of limited eggs. Okay, there's a less than 1% chance of getting a le legendary egg. How silly is this? And I need to do that to get this item. What about this one? I need to defeat the Yeti boss. I mean, come on, that is who knows where. I played this game for hours and honestly, I got nowhere. Look at all these levels I haven't even unlocked. I just gave up on this. I'm not even gonna waste my time. And the problem is there are so many games like this right now on Roblox offering limited items. They just want to milk your time and have you spend that time in their game so they can collect that sweet, sweet Robux money. I mean, honestly, I don't fault them for this. Here's another one. Look at all these limited UGC items which have not even been claimed because they are so difficult to get that people have literally just given up. And frankly, I don't blame them for giving up because I have given up myself on many of these games. I mean, you want me to sit here and pump iron for who knows how many hours? Yeah, I might as well go get a gym membership. Look at this item. I mean, there is, it's almost impossible to get that for Dora. I mean, apparently there's like a 0.00 something percent chance of getting that item you need. Here's a cowboy hat, another really difficult item to get in this game. I mean, I don't even know what's going on anymore. They just want me to spend a bunch of time in the game. I get it. Or maybe to spend Robux but this one's not for me. Moving on, here is Puppy Simulator. Now, I played this one for a while. I got a couple free items, and I guess there's a white corn dog. I don't know, maybe I have this item already. Who knows? Um, it's not even unlocking, which is kind of weird. So yeah, maybe I've already purchased it. I have no idea. But even this game, it did not have rebirths until the last time I logged in. And then I realized, oh goodness, now even this game has rebirths. So I'm sure any future items are going to require rebirths, which really just take even longer to get the item. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, look at all those dogs. I still can't get it. Who knows? It's not in my inventory. Um, here's another one. This one, you got to shoot an arrow. They're all, all of these games are kind of the same. Shoot an arrow, solve a math problem, uh, punch somebody, uh, lift the weight. I mean, they're all kind of the same. They're just, they're mindless games. This one actually looks like it could probably be doable. You got to spend two hours in the game. I don't know. Maybe it's already been all claimed. Who knows? Um, you got to defeat 5,000 friends, which really means just shooting them with an arrow. Kind of wild. But uh, yeah, let me go ahead and shoot this friend. Oh goodness, I mean, I actually feel kind of bad doing this. You know what really stinks about a game like this though, with the, the hour limit, like there's even one where it wants you to spend 24 hours in a server, is that if you do get logged out, all your progress is lost, and unfortunately, the game doesn't care. It could be no fault of your own. You could literally have a lag spike, your internet could drop, Roblox could have an error, who knows, Roblox could shut down, the server might need to reset, your computer might crash for whatever reason with WinZip or some other kind of file program being on it saying, hey, I want to do an update. Yeah, it's just crazy. I mean, goodness. Yeah, these are these games are just wild. Are you playing these games? Comment in the comment below. Tell me if you're playing these games. Tell me why you're playing these games or what's the longest time you've ever spent trying to get a free limited. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I thought it was crazy that math problem game. I actually did that Fedora game, which is actually kind of ridiculous that I played that game. I'm embarrassed to even admit it. I mean, I had my phone like with me at work and it was just sitting there just shooting at a wall for, I don't know, it felt like two days. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not doing them. Um, my future videos are going to really be targeted towards the easy ones to get or ones which are not limited okay so those items will be the ones i'll be talking about and um uh, yeah i don't feel bad about those because i don't want people to spend their whole their whole life playing a video game that they can't even really play you're really auto training the whole time that's just kind of sad i mean these games i understand they're out to make a buck but they're just not for me okay i i get no value out of playing them in fact, as you can see in this game, it has all these pop-ups wanting me to buy things to skip levels, skip walls, buy a pet, spin a wheel. I mean, come on. Literally, this pops up so many times that there are bound to be 
plenty of people who make just a mistake and click the wrong button once in a while. Even the items, I don't know, is it really worth an item that you're going to maybe try to sell or hang on to? Maybe if you really like the item, that's cool. But if you're trying to hope that you're going to be rich off of this and you get 30 Robux, newsflash, and that's not going to get you very far. You know, 30 Robux, we could do the calculator. I'll put it on the screen. 30 Robux is not going to get you very far in life or anywhere. I mean, it's not even going to get you a drink at McDonald's. And you know what really gets me upset about these kind of games is that they're all really trying to target younger children who really don't know any better. And really, unfortunately, there's no way to really tell these people, hey, don't waste your time in this game. You know, you're better off just, I don't know, do something you enjoy. So you might as well just go ahead and do something else with your time. Uh, play a game you actually like. Forget about these weird limited items that want you to spend two days in a game. Yeah, and just do something else productive. Anyway, that's my spiel. I'm Krabby John, and I'm out.